the containers are standard 40 feet uh, standard containers for shipping containers and what we've done is we've lined the actual tanks with a fiberglass membrane so it's just like a big swimming pool the filters will sit in there and this just improves the integrity of the tank so they are 100% waterproof and will contain the solution. So this is the plant room for the membrane bioreactor at Walkworth. On this site there are two different plant rooms. Um, this one controls half of the plant and the other one controls the other half of the plant so they can be separated and taken away and used in different places when they're finished here. This room houses all the pumps and blowers that are used to keep the process going. This is the membrane part of the membrane bioreactor. It's essentially an extremely fine filter that's around 10 times smaller than an individual bacteria. So we just apply a slight suction to the tube here and the water is drawn through the membrane. The bacteria and any pollution is kept outside the membrane and what comes out is essentially crystal clear, very nearly drinkable water. to look for new innovative ways to uh, promote what we do. Uh, for such a short period of time, the cost and involvement in building a completely new building here on a site that's going to be decommissioned was just not financially practical. And the main benefit is that half of this plant is now going to go forward in five years time to Waiheke Island and supplement the improvements that they're going to carry out there as well.